What's going on viewers? So today we're going to be working on basically cleaning the inside of the car. As um, so you can see behind me, I have a bunch of stuff back here. I got car covers. I have the bumper in the back. There's some tools. Um, these seats. So you can see seats are just sitting in place. So I definitely want to bolt those down. I actually found the bolts in the center console. Um, what else? What else? I want to tidy up some of the stuff here, like this trim is loose here. I want to get that in, I want to get the eight pillars in. Um, and basically go through the car, make sure that I don't find like brackets or anything that I'm going to need once I start doing the engine bay. So I might as well clean this up, make sure it's good, figure out what I need to buy to wrap it up. I know I'm going to miss in this part here where the passenger airbag used to be. I want to get the delete that uh, people put on their car. It's like a little tray. I actually have it in one of my other cars back there, but I'm order one of those. Hopefully I can find one used. Um, let's see. That's it guys, so just kind of watch along. I was going to work on the engine bay, but A, it's windy outside. Um, and I need to get my mic. So once I get my mic, with the little fussy thing, the wind blocker, uh, I'll do the engine bay and start working on taking apart the other car. Uh, so yeah, just watch along guys. Pretty sure these are the seat bolts I found on the center console. So get this done. But first we need the right socket. It looks like to be a 15. I'll be back. Alright, so check this out guys. Looks like they uh removed all the sound damning material from the driver's side. Not the passenger side though, as you can see that's still black in there, All right? Oh. We go over this side, looks like they also grinded it off, whatever they couldn't get off. But, in the process, it went a little too far over there. So now we got a hole to fix. It should be a hump, like this. Has a little hump. Grinded it down. Nuts. 
rookies. That is called rookies. Alright, so pretty much, let's see, they still even have it up here. That's dumb. Oh well, whatever. We'll fix it. Um, yeah, I'll probably just right align it. That would give it a nice thick layer, protect it against the elements, and go from there. Yeah, I gotta put these bolts here. See if you can see those or not. I put the two bolts in here. And then there's two on the back. Gotta run this harness out of the way. Because right now it's under the seat. So we'll fix that, put it on the side. As it should go. And uh, go from there. Alright, watch along. So that wraps up most of the inside. Got all cleaned up. Just got to run the vacuum real quick. Get the all the nonsense out of here. Got to right now line the back part here too, where they try to take out the sound ending. They failed. And just tying up a couple more bolts, and that's a wrap for the interior. And then all I got to do is. Basically go through the trunk and get the rest of the bolts and stuff that I have out. That in place. Wiring is loose here, but we'll fix it. All right, guys. So real quick, like I said. Um, it's kind of windy outside, so I really can't do the, the engine based stuff without recording much of anything. Um, so, we did the inside today. I'm going to do the trunk a little later. I got some errands to run, but I'll do the bolts in the trunk, show you a clip of that, and we'll just uh, start working on the engine bay afterwards once I get everything I need out of the trunk. I know I have the battery bracket and PCM bracket back there, so I definitely need that. And then we can make some real progress with this car. Uh, 
Yeah, so if you like the video, make sure you hit like. Um, if you want to stay updated, just make sure you subscribe. That way you get the notifications, guys. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next video.